Big boy. Big boy. <laughs> it is going down, man. Los Angeles Police Chief Charlie Beck in the neighborhood. He said if uh, I don't say something funny by the time you leave from over here, <laughs> you're going to have a warrant for my arrest. <laughs> <laughs> so, but, but all jokes aside, man, now, j- just with L.A. Chief Beck, where are we now as far as just, just temperatures, what's going on in the street? I know that there's been some things going on in the news. What, what's going on in, in, in Los Angeles that's on your radar right now? Well, you know, uh, a lot of what we're doing is trying to work with the youth to, to prevent gang crime. And, yeah. you know, gang violence in L.A. is really defines violence in the city. And that's why this event is so important, you know, because it shows a, a, another way. And it shows a, a way to get involved with the community, to bring people together rather than tear them apart. You know, this is this is all about all of us working together, where no matter where your parents were born or what side of the street you grew up on, you know, you can work together. And that's, and that's what the Safe Summer tip offs all about. I, I just want to add one thing. You know, Please there's do. always been a focus on gangs in L.A., and there have been mm-hmm. 29 arrests in the NFL since the Super Bowl, and I just want to say <laughs> that's the third gang we're worried about. Right, yeah, yeah. NFL players are very scary. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, we don't have a gang in this uh, city. No, yeah. we don't. No, we don't. Not, <laughs> Tell me yes. about it, man. <laughs> are we going to get a football team well, out here? I would like that. The, the chief of police has recommended highly that we get at least one, maybe two. I heard nice, that, man. man. So it's obvious that you don't have no NFL pool because we don't have one. <laughs> you know, damn it, Beck. What about you coming? Stop drinking our water. Too. <laughs> he over here, you put fires out with that. Yeah, oh, you're wasting water. Say, but we, we, back in the hole. Yeah, we got uh, we got water that we give the guests. He on his like third bottle. Man. <laughs> <laughs> but, he, but that little tea over bottles. here at these little fires pouring avion on him. That's why so many acres burn. <laughs> this dude, man. So just. Just try to win tomorrow. Hydrate yourself yeah, man. so we can get you out there and get the best you that's going on. Now, what about just with our temperature? We're expecting these, I mean, heat waves. I know that we're now in so-called fire season right now. Right. I've, I've had to really get someone out there to kind of clear my brush away. What's our temperature as far, and not temperature as in degrees, but just what we're expecting this season as far as? It's dry out there, man. We, haven't, we had uh, less than a third of the rain we usually get, about five inches this year. Everything's dry. It's tinder dry. The weather's hot. Mm-hmm. Uh, we want people to be extremely careful. Do like you did. Clear your brush out. Right. Uh, do not use fireworks this 4th of July. Go to one of the, the professional shows because that's that's just another thing that will cause those wildfires to take off. Uh, everybody's got to be extra careful, extra vigilant. How long have you been with the fire department? 34 years. Have yeah. you ever had a fire at your house? I have not had a fire. <laughs> okay, okay, <laughs> just wondering. <laughs> you know, c- because one day I was walking home with a friend of mine in uh, fourth grade, Sang Juan. Big up to Sang Juan. <laughs> and yeah, and we saw a fire truck rolling by. And we were like, you know, the sirens were going on and everything. And when we got to his house, it was his house that was on fire. So. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that, Sang Juan. I don't know where he's at now. You know, so so you know how to prevent it from happening at your house. So each one teach one. Absolutely. My father was on this job before me, just like Charlie's Damn. was on the police force before him. I heard uh. that. My dad was a. Uh, I don't know where my dad was. He left us. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I wouldn't know exactly. That wasn't a joke. No, it, was, yeah, it wasn't a, it wasn't a joke. Sorry. Yeah. Big boy. <laughs> Big boy. <laughs> it was more of a plea. Let's believe that. Y'all stick around your radio. Oh, yes, oh, go oh, ahead. You, go on, come, no, take commercial. No, you no, should. Take, take commercial. You sent the Arsenio uh, Hall I, I show. I apologize. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude, oh you think gosh. you're really Just in the driver's seat? You nine nine thirteen is your date. All right, it's a, don't it's worry a about what I do here every day. I, I ain't mad at I'm you, I'm surprised brother. I didn't put an I at the end of your name. Right. Oh, don't do I'm that. I'm doing everything wrong. Hey, man, no, but you know what, Arsenio, you look like foul footage. <laughs> you you look like yesterday, man. Like so, you'll be able to step right in and probably use some of the old footage from the old show and get away with it, man. We're gonna talk about the show coming up, also, man. Ooh, All right, we got ooh. our city hall in the neighborhood, big boy big neighborhood. Boy.